Okay, so let's have a look at simple interest. So simple interest basically is your principal multiplied by the rate multiplied by the time. So principal, this is the money that has been invested. So this is all to do with saving an investment from the, your chapter. So let's take, for example, John saves 3,000 euro at a rate of 10%. And he's going to save it for, let's say, three years. So we need to identify three things. So we look at a formula. We need to know our principal, which is the money that has been invested. We need to know the rate and we need to know the time. So from this question, the money that's been invested is 3,000. So your principal is 3,000. The rate then is how much interest he's going to receive each year. So the bank is going to give him a rate. And in this question, the rate is 10%. And the time, how long is he going to save it for? So he's going to put his 3,000 into the bank. He's going to leave it there for three years. And the bank is going to give him 10% per year for leaving the money there. So we need to find out how much interest he will earn on the 3,000 after three years. So we're going to take these pieces of information. We're going to put them into the form. So the formula is the principal multiply by the rate, multiply by time. And we've identified the principal is 3,000. We've identified the rate is 10%. And we've identified that the time is three years. So we need to put this into our calculator. So if you've got a calculator, you're going to put in 3,000 multiplied by 10 equals, and you're going to divide that by 100, because that's your 10%. That's going to give you a percentage per year for one year. And we need to multiply that by 3 then to see how much you're going to earn for the three years. So the answer is 900 euro. So if he invests 3,000 in a savings, in a bank and he leaves it there for ten, three years he's going to receive 900 euro so 900 euro is your answer